Rebecca Luz has hit out at David Beckham in a scathing response to his newly released documentary series with wife Victoria on Netflix, including a fair allegations. In 2004, football legend David was hit with claims he had an affair with Rebecca, 46, who alleged she had a relationship with him while he was playing for Real Madrid. The former Manchester United ace, who was hit with allegations of affairs with other women, described the claims as ludicrous at the time. Almost 20 years on from Rebecca first claiming she had an affair with Bex, both Victoria and David have seemingly addressed the rumors. Speaking in the new Netflix series Beckham, the couple open up about how the affair allegations impacted their relationship, with Victoria admitting we were against each other. In her first response to the series, Rebecca shook her head at its coverage of the alleged affair. It's all, poor me. He needs to take responsibility, she told the Mail on Sunday. He can say whatever he likes of course and I understand he has an image to preserve, but he is portraying himself as the victim and has making me look like a liar, like I've made up these stories. In one episode of the four-part series, Beckham director Fisher Stevens asks David, multiple tabloid stories broke, and how did you deal with that? The dad of four replies, there were some horrible stories that were difficult to deal with. It was the first time that me and Victoria had been put under that kind of pressure in our marriage. Stevens then quizzes David's wife and former Spice Girl Victoria, 49, about their marriage troubles. 100%. It was the hardest period for us, Posh recalls. Because it felt like the world was against us. And here's the thing, we were against each other, if I'm being completely honest. You know, up until Madrid sometimes it felt like us against everybody else. But we were together. We were connected. We had each other. But when we were in Spain, it didn't really feel that we had each other either. And that's sad. I can't even begin to tell you how hard it was and how it affected me. In response, Rebecca told the mail. He is indirectly suggesting that I'm the one who has made Victoria suffer. In the show, David adds, When I first moved to Spain it was difficult because I've been part of a club and a family for my whole career from the age of 15 to I was 27 years old. I get sold overnight. The next minute I am in a city. I don't speak the language. More importantly, I didn't have my family. He goes on to describe his marriage was as a feeling of drowning as he explains, every time that we woke up we felt you know, there was something else and you know, I think we both felt at the time that we were, not losing each other, but drowning. There were some days that I would wake up and think how am I gonna go to work? How am I gonna walk onto that training pitch? How am I going to look as if nothing's wrong? I felt physically sick every day. When I opened my eyes. How am I going to do this? When the director asks how the pair got through the tough time, David admits, I don't know how we got through it in all honesty. Victoria is everything to me. To see her hurt was incredibly difficult. But we are fighters. And at that time we needed to fight for each other, we needed to fight for our family. And what we had was worth fighting for. But ultimately it's our private life. In April 2004, the now defunct News of the World published claims by David's former personal assistant Rebecca Luz that he and Rebecca had an extramarital affair. Rebecca claimed the affair took place after she was assigned to look after David in Spain following his transfer from Manchester United to Real Madrid in 2003. 
Rebecca alleged her romantic dalliance with Bex took place over the course of four months, with wife Victoria unaware. The now 46-year-old's claims were never verified and David blasted his former assistant's allegations as ludicrous at the time, but never launched legal action against either Rebecca or the news of the world. Follow Mirror Celebs on Snapchat, Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, YouTube and Threads. Just me.